The faster you see results, the easier it is to stick to a goal. None of these suggestions will make you rich, but they will help you grow your savings quickly. Here are 10 quick money saving ideas. Number one, cancel any subscription services or memberships that you don't need. Get rid of any unnecessary subscriptions if you wanna be a good saver. Perhaps you signed up for a free trial of a new streaming service and then forgot to cancel it. Maybe you have a gym membership that you don't use anymore. Look for recurring subscription charges on your monthly credit card or bank statements. Put the money you saved after you've canceled any unnecessary services into your savings account. Number two, use an app to automate your savings. Consider using an app that does the work for you if you frequently forget to put money into your savings account or if you don't know how much to save. There are a plethora of apps available to help you automate your savings. Two options are Capital and Digit. These automatic savings apps are designed to move money on your behalf, so you don't have to think about it. With these apps, you won't get the best or sometimes any APY on your deposits, so once you've amassed a sizable sum, consider transferring it to a high-yield savings account. Number 3. Unwanted items can be sold. For a quick cash injection, sell items you don't need. Find the dress, ring, or hiking boots you no longer wear in your closet, attic, garage, or storage space. Then, write a blog post about the items and sell it them on eBay or Nextdoor, for example. You could also sell items you no longer use at a local thrift store. A garage sale could be a good way to get rid of a lot of stuff at once. To avoid regrets, do your homework regardless of your strategy. Before you sell something for less than it's worth, make sure you know how much it's worth. Number 4. Change Banks Account fees bring in a lot of money for banks. According to a Center for Responsible Lending Analysis of FDIC data, big banks with at least $1 billion in assets made $11.68 billion in overdraft and non-sufficient funds fees alone in 2019. It's simple to avoid monthly fees, especially at online banks. According to Bankrate's 2020 checking account and .EM fee study, nearly half 47% of checking accounts that don't turn interest are free. Some banks will even reward you with a substantial bonus simply for opening an account. Look for a savings account that pays a competitive interest rate. To find a savings account that meets your needs, compare them. Number 5. Short-Term Certificate of Deposit CD A one-year CD may provide you with a higher rate of return than a savings account. Plus, the annual percentage yield a PY on a CD is usually fixed. You're guaranteed to earn the APY if you keep the money in the CD for the entire term. If you think you'll need money before the CDS term is up, avoid CDs so you don't have to pay early withdrawal penalties. Number 6. Put an end to paying for convenience. Convenience can save you time, but it can also cost you money. Taking a few minutes out of your day to brew your own coffee or clean and repair things around the house can help you save money. Reduce your spending on things you don't care about. If coffee is important to you, it's fine to buy it from a coffee shop, but find something else to cut. Number 7. Purchase with cash or set a limit on your credit card. Using cash instead of a credit card to make a purchase can trick your brain into saving money every time you go to the store. Your spending limit is determined by the amount of money you have. With a credit card, it's all too easy to lose track of your spending limits. Number 8. Examine your recurring bills again. To possibly save money, look into your cable, satellite, or streaming options. You may begin with a good deal from your cable or satellite provider that expires after a certain amount of time. After a few years, you might be able to save money by finding a new deal. Number 9. Reconsider your housing expenses. Housing expenses, such as rent or mortgage payments, are among the most significant in most budgets. If you move to a place with lower rent, you may be able to start saving right away. Refinancing your mortgage can save you money on your monthly payments as well as over time. However, make sure it's appropriate for your situation. Number 10. Look for insurance quotes from different companies. You can save money by shopping around for insurance. As a new customer, you may be able to get a better deal, or you can contact your current insurer and ask them to lower your current rate if it has increased. Bundling insurance products from the same provider can also help you save money.